Today is a celebration. It's a celebration of love, of commitment, of friendship, of family. and of two people who are in it forever. as they make their commitment to journey through life together as husband and wife. Sitting on the couch in the basement at your mama's house When we saw the last bit of your sister's we were blowing that smoke in the vacuum cleaner The day I knew I was going to marry Samara, there was a lady, she was homeless and um, she had a, her daughter with her that we, we didn't have much to offer. Samara actually gave our last money away for this, um, for this lady to stay at a hostel with her daughter. I already thought she had a massive heart, but um, yeah, that was definitely the day that um, I, I knew I'd, I'd definitely propose to Samara. I can't be happier than I am right now, than I am right now. I can't be happier than I am. Steel. He's uh, funny, very sporty, devoted dad, and usually he's pretty chilled, easy going, just happy, lovable chap, just chilled, yeah. He's just like, just going with the flow kind of guy. <laughs> the opposite of me, pretty much. <laughs> I'm told, dreaming is what keeps you from growing old. Still the same kids sitting on the couch, pretending that I got it all figured out. Like, oh, we got this. It's gonna be so big. I don't know where we're going, but I don't really care. I go out on. Samara is the camera person. It should be just all focused on her. <laughs> Growing up beside Sam, it was me, a four and a half, maybe a five with good lighting, against a fucking ten. <laughs> <laughs> she had it all. She was, she was stunning, stunning, intelligent, killer athlete, caring, kind. So cute. <laughs> and, and just as you thought that there was no room for improvement, along comes Stilo. <laughs> We got all we need. What a blessing. I got you here with me. We got sunshine. We got all we need. What a blessing. Got you here with me. You have been invited here today because Samara and Steele want to acknowledge the important part 
that each of you plays in their lives. Fake cry. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Surely. Like I would. I'd be scared if I didn't cry for Samara. <laughs> oh. No doubt in my mind. There I is no doubt. Will. I think you will stop. <laughs> He better, otherwise I'm gonna start again and then <laughs> I'm just gonna start again. <laughs> nah, yeah, I think he will. He's a softie. He's, yeah, he'll, he'll cry. Everyone's gonna cry. <laughs> it's gonna be good. Still, standing here in front of you today is a representation of my love and commitment to you. Without you, I would be stagnant. You are a pillar of my growth, and because of you, I've been able to flourish as an individual. Samara, I still remember the day I said that I'll marry you one day. I'm a very simple person. I never thought I would find someone special like you. I always thought love was just feelings. Uh, since growing with you, I know this is uh, highs, lows, success, failures, learnings, growings, encouragings, supportings, and tolerating. I believe in you the person you will grow to be and the couple will be together. Because of you, I laugh. Because of you, I feel safe. I love you, I respect you, and with my whole heart, I take you as my husband. I absolutely adore you. I admire everything about you. I stand here today to commit my love to you and all I have until my last day. I will dream with you, celebrate with you, and walk beside you through whatever our lives may bring. You are my person, my love, my headache, <laughs> and my life. Today and always, I love you forever, my soulmate. Waiting for the moment to arrive, I was waiting. These sands represent your lives and your journeys that have led you to today. The sand in Steele's bottle is from the Hotham River in Boddington, and the sand in Samara's bottle is from De Grey River, Port Hedland. Just as the sands blend together, never to be separated, may your lives blend together and may the bonds of your love never be broken. With friends and family as your witnesses, I now declare you husband and wife. Congratulations. And much delight to introduce to you the wonderful Mr. and Mrs. Viti. Congratulations. thankful that she came into our lives because we're all really glad that we met someone as kind and caring as she is. I 
I'd just like to say that I'm very thankful to have you as a stepmother because you've helped me through a lot. Um, congratulations to my sister. Thank you for everything you have done for me. Can't forget about Steel. Uh, you're my favourite brother-in-law. And, and I'm, I'm glad to say that you're in my family. Um, but if you break my sister's heart, I'll break your legs. <laughs> So family and friends, how is it that we come to be gathered here today for Steele and Samara's special moment? Uh, that's not so romantic. The, uh, um, I actually noticed Samara a few times um, out exercising. I mean, I feel like he stalked me a bit. Honestly, like, I, yeah, he, I would go for my afternoon jogs and I would see his one um, work ute constantly driving past with this big dark guy in there. <laughs> and then um, just like any other like romantic story, we met on social media, like properly. When we first got wind of steel, like let's be honest, we weren't a fan. No, oh, like, yeah. They're they, older than her. They got that bit of an age gap, but now like he's stuck with us, so <laughs> yeah. I took Samara and Ashani to their first party and I noticed that this big guy, you know, was looking at Samara and I'm thinking, oh my god, you know, we had a few this is time to go. <laughs> Come on, Samara. You know, being the big sister that I am, I was super protected. I said, come on, move along. And it was only a few years ago I realised that was still. <laughs> Like compliment each other. Um, they um, they've gotten better than what they was before. <laughs> they're like little teenagers, you know, when they first when you first get together and just want to be with each other every day. That's how they are. I'm just really grateful to have Samara in my life because she handles situations easier. <laughs> For Mr. and Mrs. Beatty. These two not being together wouldn't make sense. They were destined for each other. It fills me with such joy to have witnessed this day and be a part of this celebration. What an example you two have set. I couldn't be more proud and honoured to call you my sister and my brother-in-law. I think for you still, Samara has been your calm to your storm. She's been a voice of reason when your head is heated, your judgment is clouded. You're better for being with her. She has been that loving, strong, supportive partner that you have longed for, the mother that you needed for your children, the wife you've needed. It makes me happy as a sister to know you've found someone you can love and count on wholeheartedly. We only aim to be the best friends and best family that we can to everyone in this room um, and with those same values I aim to be the best partner 
and father I can be. And I know Samara's definitely an awesome mother and partner. Everyone that is here today is obviously dearest to us. And we appreciate you coming and showing your love and support. And we're just happy to spend this special day with you all. In the marriage, the little things are the big things. It's never being too old to hold hands. It's remembering to say, I love you, often. This is where we begin. Oh. It's standing together, facing the world. It's forming a circle of love that gathers in the whole family. It is not only marrying the right partner, it is being the right partner. And that is the art of marriage. Oh.